What I believe in is creativity. I believe that all of us are very creative deep inside ourselves and it just finds different ways to manifest. People express their creativity in other kinds of ways. They, um, uh, they paint or draw or dance or they uh, design better political systems or they make laws or they build clocks or they uh, make a very fine set of steps uh, 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 out of wood at the cottage, you know. There are all kinds of ways of, of being creati creative and, and building and making and all of us I think are, are fed by doing that and that's something that's interesting to me is why that creativity is so important to all of us. I think that we feel a, a certain loss or a lack if, we, if we're not finding ways to express ourselves creatively, whatever those might be. The model for the Wolzenberg clock is the medieval monumental astronomical clock in Strasbourg, France. W one of the things about the Strasbourg clock is that it was built over three different periods. It was built originally in the medieval era, era and then built again in the Renaissance and one last time in the Enlightenment. And it occurred to me as I was sitting having coffee that that the the, the time between each of those periods was, was far enough that the the different makers of the clock likely had no real knowledge of one another and so they had their own story. So the whole structure of the novel unfolded for me there under the Granville Street Bridge of uh, a narrator telling the story of these three different periods of the clock's construction. I had the good fortune to be able to go to Strasbourg to see the clock there and it really is a fantastic device uh, both in its complexity and its beauty and I was lucky enough to be able to spend a, a couple of days there and and a lot of the time I was I simply sat in the cathedral and was aware of its life aware that the clock that somewhere inside the clock dials were turning very very slowly to make things happen and uh, so it was a, a beautiful kind of reverie sitting there and thinking about that.